Is your too new to be broken Frigidaire model FG4H2272UF 36 inch counter depth French door fridge no longer making ice? Have you already tried replacing your water filter? Still no luck? Maybe you noticed some frost accumulation? Uh, this happened to me. Very frustrating. I came across a bunch of old videos that were not specific to my model. I found the service data sheet that uh, has a safety note that this is specifically designed for qualified repair personnel. That's me today. I'm going to be doing a short, sweet video that shows you how to go through the system diagnostics mode to force your ice maker to defrost. The service data sheet is linked below. There's a number of different diagnostic modes you can enter. We're going to be focused on FZ, as in freezer, left side, display 72, test fresh food, I am defrost heater, I am being the ice maker. This is an alternative to using the blow dryer heat gun method that I've seen in other videos. And this is also the way I assume a tech would go about uh, forcing your ice maker into defrost mode. I know the top of the service data sheet says ice and water automatic defrost, but that's just not the experience that many of us are having. That's the reason a lot of us are out here with the hair dryers in our ice trays. So. Okay, first thing, go ahead and make sure your fridge looks like my fridge. I gave you the model number earlier. Here's a quick glimpse of everything. You have that middle drawer. This is what my display looks like. You're going to want to touch the plus and minus on the freezer side. Hold it for about 10 seconds. Feels like it's not going to work. It's going to work. Keep holding. It gets boring. There it goes. When you see all the lights go on, the display, that means you're in diagnostic mode. Lights inside the fridge should turn off. You're going to want to hit the plus side on the refrigerator temp side. It'll go blank. Tap it one more time. You're now in diagnostic mode. Number two, our first test mode, freezer defrost heater, touch cube to turn it on, cube to turn it back off. You're going to click the positive on the fridge side to click through the different test modes. We're going to click the positive until we get to 72. Now, fair warning, when I get to 72, I turn it on just to show you what it looks like. Then I turn it off and click to the next mode. I'm not going to leave it on because I don't need to defrost my ice maker. 72. This is the fresh food. I am defrost heater mode. We're going to click cube to turn it on. Here we see the temperature. It's reading negative 13. You will see that gradually rise as it's left in defrost mode. I'm going to turn it off or go to the next mode here just to show you how to get out of it go to your next test to get out of diagnostic mode you're gonna touch the positive and negative on the freezer side of the display feels like it's not gonna work keep holding it it's quite boring there it is it's now it's out of diagnostic mode when all the lights come on give it a second don't touch anything it'll probably beep all right now you're good to go it'll show the power lost notification touch any key on your display you're good to go I would say wait about 24 hours and you should have ice if you don't have ice after you've done that and you've switched your water filter I don't know what to tell you buddy just kidding I do know what to tell you buddy pretend you're qualified personnel pretend that the service data sheet was designed for you and you know exactly how to use it run through these tests see if you can dwindle it down to possible cause or maybe a part that has gone bad so if this doesn't work for you get back to it 